EHD, epizootic hemorrhagic disease. We're going to do a deep dive into that today and talk about what you need to know and why you need to know it as a hunter. So EHD is a virus similar to the flu. A couple differences. Primarily is symptomatic in ruminant mammals. Cattle, sheep, deer, they can all be infected by it. Sheep, it's pretty bad, but, but deer, it's absolutely devastating. White-tailed deer have no immunity built up for EHD. Late summer, water levels are getting low, right at the edge of these ponds or stagnant little areas of a creek that has quit flowing. Water gets low, and just like mosquitoes and other types of bugs, they're laying their eggs in that water. They turn into larvae, they go through all their stages, and then they, from those shallow waters, emerge a flying little critter, and the females can carry EHD. When they bite a deer, that's not the only deer that they bite. They live off of the blood of a deer, so they'll land on a deer, they're going to bite it, they're going to feed off of it for a short period of time, and then they're going to fly to another deer. Wind currents can kind of change this. That's why it spreads so quickly. It's not because deer herds are necessarily roaming and migrating. It's as the wind currents change, they can blow it into a new area. And as they bite other hosts, they're spreading EHD. According to Cornell University, EHD has a five to 10 day incubation period, meaning after you've been bit, and become infected within five to 10 days, that deer is gonna become symptomatic. Once they're symptomatic, EHD kills deer very quickly. Eight to 36 hours, 48 hours on the top end, the deer is dead. And it does not matter age, size, sex, none of that. It's brutal. As hunters, we know what it takes for an animal to reach maturity for a buck to get four, five, six years old. They've got to avoid getting shot. They've got to survive winters. They've got to survive the rut, not get hit by a car. You know, it's, it's tricky. And with so many of them die when they're fawns, it's just a bummer to see a, a nice mature animal die from EHD. But if you've been hearing about EHD lately on social media, probably not been from any news networks or state agencies other than the state of Ohio. Ohio's DNR has been putting up a heat map for the last couple weeks showing confirmed EHD deaths by county and uh, so kudos to them but outside of, of the ODNR there are, are very few people in the hunting world talking about EHD other than hunters posting pictures of dead deer they're finding on their properties. One of the symptoms of EHD is a really high fever and it'll draw these deer to drink a ton of water and jump in and swim in a pond or a creek and eight to 36 hours after symptoms start showing, you know, they're dead. So a lot of these are dead, found dead in a pond. Another symptom is when you walk on your property, you can smell death in the air. You can smell a dead deer. That may mean you have an EHD problem. There's a veterans hunt I volunteer with every year. And a few years ago, EHD hit this herd really bad, and we found a ton of dead deer. One of the heartbreaking symptoms of, of EHD, these, these deer lose all fear of humans, and that, that sometimes is a symptom people pick up on. A lot of farmers will pick up on that. You'll see videos of people farming or on a tractor, and there's a, a deer just standing there kind of panting, just looking like a zombie. Also, according to Cornell University, there are no prevention plans in place and there is no treatment for HD, hemorrhagic diseases. A lot of people call EHD blue tongue. 
blue tongue is is a hemorrhagic disease out west that kills pronghorns and mule deer and Rocky Mountain bighorn sheep and stuff like that. It's the exact same symptoms, so I don't think anybody really cares. So yeah, what we're dealing with in Appalachia and in the South and the Midwest, I mean that's that's uh, that's EHD. And the only way for anybody to care is if all of us hunters start talking about it. Southern Ohio has been hit by it pretty bad the last few years. I kind of thought with all the rain we've gotten this year, it wouldn't be that bad. But it's been pretty arid, pretty dry here the last couple weeks. I think there's a lot of confusion about EHD. You know, people ask if it's a parasite, is it, you know, that's why the frost kills it. And the frost does kill it in a way. It'll kill all the midges that carry it. So, you know, the problem with that is, is there's a lot of places that don't get a thick frost until November. So then you're dealing with dead deer from August to November. I mean, who knows, if we had a really bad drought year in a couple years, what that could do to any given state's deer herd, deer population. There's gotta be something that can be done. There is one new product out that treats the water. Other than that, I've not heard of anything. <clears throat> I heard a rumor that there was a feed a supplemental medicated feed you could feed your deer herd but i don't know and it just makes you wonder about cwd how big of a deal cwd is everywhere and i'm sure it's a big deal but i've never seen a cwd deer dead i've never seen a deer with cwd period thought i did two years ago but it turns out it was just a doe that got hit by a car and was just kind of loopy walking circles in a guy's yard for a little bit and then ran off ehd sure seems to be a lot more deadly than cwd I think it was 2021 the first time I walked up on a dead EHD deer, and it is shocking. And I think if if hunters start encountering this, start talking about it, that's the only way anything's going to be done to help this. But something needs done. But thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Uh, feel free to put in the comments if you've encountered an EHD situation or if EHD has hit your deer herd. Let me know what you think. I appreciate you watching. Cheers. Thanks. Man, this place is a freaking jungle, dude. Absolutely unbelievable. It is taller than my head, baby. I need a tractor. I need a tractor. Perfecto. Can you hear the girls back there?